in terms of the music thing, like for example, when Jeezy and Gucci were going at it, mm. or going at it, like I remember, I think uh, Jeezy made a song that was like, yeah, I got 25,000 for, for Gucci Man's chain. And then that turned Gucci into a fucking target. And then not long afterwards, there was a home invasion and then someone ended up dying and, and everything else like that. Right, so you, see, that's what, that's you what... see the bullshit bleed into real life situations. Oh, of course. No, I'm not, I'm not saying that can't happen. But I'm not. I, I can't just blame music. That happens because of people, of people just not liking each other. Sometimes, shit happens. Like I said, when a lot of us came out, we had egos. Gucci man was a crazy nigga. Nigga, nigga was catching Gucci cases. Gucci was definitely crazy. You know what I'm saying? Fifties crazy. Jay Z. All these niggas was niggas was really in the streets, bro. You taking street niggas and you trying to change them. It takes time. Yeah. It takes time for you to mature. Right. Like I look at a lot of shit that we've been through and just happy that. Niggas are still alive. Nobody got hit. Nobody's dead. You know, well, a couple of niggas got hit, but you know what I'm saying? Like, There's G-Unit people that aren't around. Yeah. Rest, rest in peace, Maserati Fox. Yeah, Lodi Mac. Lodi Mac. The list go, there's a list that goes on. But there's a list, there's a, there's any, unfortunately, any day you too big of a list. Any day you could have caught a bullet, you know what I'm saying? Because with fame, a lot of it comes with it. Mm -hmm. You're famous now, so you got to watch how you move. Old friends might not think that you amped up because you, you're moving different. Cause you come to the hood too much, niggas are gonna say you broke. If you don't come to the hood, niggas are gonna say you bougie. Either way, you don't you don't win. Sometimes you might come to the hood, certain niggas don't want to speak, so now you're feeling awkward. You don't give a fuck, cause I let my nuts hang everywhere I go. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So, like, why I feel awkward when I can go somewhere and be loved? I can go hang with my lawyer. He's inviting me to the fucking Knicks game. Right. But meanwhile, I might go to the hood, check niggas, and one nigga might be acting awkward because he don't know how to feel around me. Right. You know what I mean? Or ain't seen me in a minute. Go, so ha go hang I out go with Vlad to, at the country I, club. Yeah, go <laughs> hang with Vlad at Calabasas Country Club, shit yep. like that. Right. You don't even know I'm in L.A. because that's how I move. I move militant. Right. But like like I said, everybody ain't going to love you. Like like I said, I go to the hood. There's, there's people that I gave money to and might see them a year or two later and they act like, I ain't give them some money, a couple of hundred for Christmas or whatever. They might not want to say hi. Cool. And I know these people. Or see them at a funeral and they won't say hi. They want to act awkward. Like, listen, I don't want you to kiss my ass. I'm still, I just feel like I'm blessed. I don't feel like I'm better than nobody. You know what I'm saying? As much as I love caviar pancakes, when I come back here, I wanted a beef patty with cocoa bread. Straight from the Jamaican store on Southside. I'm right in the hood. I'm just moving militant. You might, you ain't gonna know where I'm at. I don't I know how to move. Cause I didn't have cars, Bentleys, all that shit get shot up, car chases on the highway, cause people identify you from the car. I might be in a hoopty. I might be in something low key. I might Yeah, when I mentioned in Calabasas, you were in a hoopty. Yeah, I'm in a fucking hoopty. Right. I you remember. You wouldn't even know. I remember that. That shit had Vegas plates, tents. <laughs> you wouldn't even know because I like moving like yeah. that, because I know how it is. You LA is to the point now, you know how it is. You go yeah. shopping on Rodeo, the fucking girl yeah. right there might be Grape Street. You go yeah. to town. You get shot for your Richard Mill watch <laughs> yeah. right there on Rodeo. You go to That's town. happened. The way there's Mexican mafia. You yeah. know what I'm saying? You yeah. you just never know. You never you, know. You never know who knows who his cousin is this, or you you never know.